this video, I am going to talk about how to take LinkedIn skill assessment test and how this test will help you to get the job. Here you can see that in my profile, I have earned 14 badges. That means I have passed in 14 skill assessment test and there is a reason I earned 14 badges from this test test. Now I'm showing you how you can do it for yourself. Okay, well, so to participate in this skill assessment test, all you need to do is the very first you need to log in your LinkedIn profile. Then you need to scroll your profile to go down and here you will find this um, skill and endorse made options. Under this option here you can find this take skill quiz option. Okay, so before going to this quiz i'd like to make you clear one thing that why you need to take this skill assessment test because you may have a lot of skills in your profile but these are not something like that there is no guarantee that whether you have these skills or not whenever any employer visits in your profile they may find your skills but they don't know whether these are real or not in this case skill assessment test help you to make them believe that you have really these skills and this LinkedIn skill assessment test will help you to prove that you are not lying about your skills. So that's the reason you should take these skills. So to take skills, you just need to simply click over take skill quiz. So when you click here, then you will find these four options here. First one is all. These all options includes all the skill assessment tests randomly and as recommended. That means on the basis of your profile, LinkedIn will recommend you some assessment test that you need or you should take part. And here the third one is industry knowledge. The based on the industry, they will recommend or um, suggest you some test that you can do. And last one is tools and technology related all the assessment test. Here you can see all the technology and tools related assessment test here. So if you want, you can start from there, 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 or from the all. So it is all up to you, and you can scroll it down, and you can choose any of the test what you are going to pass. And remember one thing: these tests are really difficult to pass. I'm showing you one. For example, you'd like to um, give take part here after effects. Just simply need to click over there. Then here you can find that already 140k people took this assessment. And the duration of this assessment is 1.5 minutes for questions and you will get in total 15 questions and these all are multiple choice and there's one thing that accessibility mode if you think that you have some uh, problem it could be your net problem or it could be any disability problem you can turn off sorry turn on this accessibility mode here and then click here simply apply if you do you can do it Okay, so now if you click here start button, then you will get 15 questions as I'm not prepared for passing or power participating in this test. That is the reason I don't click here start. But if you think that you can click here practice. Okay, then you can learn a lot of things from this or about this after refuse assessment. So if you do it carefully, then you may be able to pass in the final exam. So, okay now the important thing and the thing that will help you to pass in this exam basically or truly these are really difficult to pass here hardly a few people pass in this test but i have one solution for you if you'd like to pass in this test then there's one youtube channel that will help you to pass in this assessment test so check my video description here i will give you the link of that channel so you can take help from that channel to pass in this assessment test so I think it will be helpful for you to pass this assessment test and it will enrich your LinkedIn profile. So I think you should participate in this assessment test right now.